my Face My Body Awards with Dr. Ahn, female plastic surgeon. Actually, I think you're the only female plastic surgeon here. Really? Yeah. Yes. That's so incredible. That's an achievement in itself. Well, there aren't many of us. I mean, I think internationally only 14% of plastic surgeons were one women. How did you do it? How did you get through? Uh, it was uh, easy. Yeah, it was really tough, actually. Um, I remember being my first year of training and I was pregnant with my daughter and a senior consultant, you know, seriously said to me, do I take my career seriously? So it's been a tough battle the whole way through just to be able to work as hard as everyone else and be taken seriously. And I think the reality is, you know, it makes you even more determined just to show that you know, I'm not asking for any free passes here. I'm happy to learn my way and improve this as well. Well, you um, certainly are doing that. You're from a multi-award winning now. And, um, oh my goodness, and you're just a finalist in the Telstra Awards? Yeah, no, that was, a, that was lovely. That was a, a real eye-opener, just that there are so many incredible women in Australia. That, that, that's, that's what's really amazing. And this is the second year? Yeah. Second year yeah. in a row that you've won My Face My Body. Yeah. yeah it's nice. It's very exciting. Yeah, and exciting. Um, any tips or secrets on what makes your clinic so successful? Um, I don't know. I think it's, you know, we're all passionate about our industry, so we're all passionate about what we do. I think it's about surrounding yourself with a fabulous team of committed, uh, you know, aesthetic uh, practitioners who share the vision and share your passion and want to help people. I mean, we're all about helping people transform themselves so they feel better about themselves. And yeah. I think that's really key. I mean, you know, we like to be cutting edge. We like to be ahead in terms of being a bit different and standing out. Um, we build relationships with our clients. And I think, I don't know, I think it's, it's probably just it's a combination of lots of things. Um, yeah. And will you be entering My Face, My Body again next year? Uh, I think I have to come down for all the all of the work that's gone into recently. I promised my husband and my kids and I promise when I come back you'll see a bit more of me because I think for the last few few months of Cliffley we opened our second clinic crown and that took a lot of my time and uh, and then the Telstra Business Women's Awards that was a big you know uh, a big process as well a long process and then this and just being away from home. You certainly do a lot of juggling. Yeah I, I like to be busy. Fun. It's good fun. It's exciting. It's an exciting well. industry. It's an exciting <laughs> industry to be a part of. I think yeah. you know if you can inspire and encourage other you know people to get into it, particularly women, uh, that you know I think that there's often a misconception that it's hard to be able to have a successful career in our industry and in surgery as well as combine it with having a family. Yes. And I think that the Absolutely. truth is it is totally possible. You just have to be willing to. Work hard and have the courage to keep going despite it or not. Hey, such an inspiration. I've got goosebumps. No, no, truly, it's, it's so inspiring. It, it is, it, it's tough. You've got a box, you know, stacked against you. But, um, but congratulations, you did so well. Yes. It's such a credit to you and your, your team. And hopefully, this award will, award will go with the other and um, be another busy year for you. Yeah, no, no, it's, it's, it's a real honour uh, to be recognised by your peers. And I'm just excited. And awards like this celebrates the whole industry. And so we're happy when our colleagues do well and you know, achieve. Well, thank you so much for your time. Thank you, Alfie.